decision in Fort Worth ISD where officials have to determine how to teach sex ed in one of the largest school districts in Texas. People packed tonight's school board meeting in anticipation of that vote. Sydney Percy was there and joins us live with the latest. Well, Chris, right now board members are in a private closed door meeting, but any minute now we are expecting them to return to vote on whether to approve this new sex ed curriculum for Fort Worth schools. So for context, the district suspended its existing sex ed program last year following some parent concerns. That curriculum tackled a wide range of topics, including sexual orientation and gender identity. So again, board members are here tonight to decide whether to approve this new curriculum. That curriculum, it is called Choosing the Best, and it is an abstinence-based, abstinence center program. So as you can imagine, there are a lot of people who had a lot of things to say about this. Uh, as you mentioned, this was a packed board meeting. We heard from a lot of different folks, parents, teachers, students, pastors, taxpayers, that are split on this issue. A lot argued that choosing the best method, it doesn't educate kids nearly enough, that it simply glosses over or ignores deeply important sex concepts. A lot of other those, a lot of other uh, folks though, said that this program is age appropriate, based in morality and based in fact. If you want to shield your child from sex ed, keep them locked up in your church or your expensive private school, but don't you dare impose your religious agenda on my grandchildren's secular education. You can call uh, abstinence-based curriculum hateful, shameful, and self-righteous. The reality is that we are advocating that teenagers be taught to be responsible with their body, to value morality, and to put the power back in the hands of the parents. Again, those two speakers were just two out of two hours worth of speakers tonight. As I mentioned, board members are still in executive dis uh, session discussing we are waiting for them to come back with a vote on whether to approve this plan. We will update you online and on air on daybreak with what they decide. Chris, Izzy.